Hi friends, here in this video, I will be explaining what is meant by load lost in friction. Load lost in friction is basically defined as the difference between ideal load and actual load. I will write the definition here. Then it is denoted by W suffix F that is the load lost in friction and it is given by the formula the load lost in friction is ideal load minus actual load Ideal load is denoted by W suffix I whereas actual load is denoted by W. Now when there is an ideal machine in that case the friction is absent so compared to an actual machine we can lift huge amount of load in case of an ideal machine. So WI value would be greater than W because it is present in an ideal machine in which the friction is not there so there is no need to overcome the frictional resistance whatever the effort is applied that is used just to lift the load so wi value will always be greater than w value that is ideal load is always greater than the actual load and this wi value we can get it from the efficiency formula like since efficiency is given by ma upon vr and if the machine is ideal efficiency is 1 or we can say 100% so therefore MA becomes equal to VR and this is the case to be used only in case of an ideal machine therefore MA is load upon effort is equal to VR and since we want ideal load so here I would be adding a suffix I so therefore wi becomes p into vr so i'll just i'll just put this value of wi over here so it is p into vr So this is the formula for load loss in friction and the unit can be either in terms of Newton or it can be in terms of kilo Newton and as we have seen here that is in case of an ideal machine the ideal load which we are lifting is greater or comparatively greater to the load which we would be lifting in a machine in which friction is there that is actual machine and their difference is called as the load lost in friction. At the end, if you will find my videos helpful, you will can like, share, comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.